So we have restarted our system into BIOS and you will press F12 or whatever the key for the boot menu is for your system. And after that, you will select the USB UEFI Sandex. I'm using the Sandex, so I, so I use Sandisk. And you press Enter. So after pressing Enter, you will wait. So we have booted into our USB. <clears throat> and from here you can see the blue one is USB installer Mac, Mac install from USB and if I go in options you can see the boot flag I'm using right now these are the one and SMBIOS I'm using is 18.3 for my cable X system and then we return and we press enter and remember to plug your USB into USB drive 2.0 not instead of USB 3.0 it can cause a lot of different errors if you plug USB 2.0 if you plug in USB 3.0 so it's better you plug it in USB 2.0 and this loading is also real time I didn't forward it, it so you can understand how long it can take to boot into the macOS Mojave from your USB Is going through a lot of different things and I normally don't see this while I do the macOS high Sierra or Sierra or any older version of Mac installation so this is kind of a different than the normal ones and it is and it took a lot a lot more time than a normal boot of older macOS versions. So finally we are booted into our USB and from here we will first of all go to the disk utility and I will format the Mo macOS Mojave that I created using my OS X because I've already installed an operating system on it. So I will format it. You press done and you close this and you go to install mac os you click continue 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 agree you click this and you click install so we are installing our mac os 10.14 through a usb installer and let's see how long it's gonna take. So it's mentioning five minutes and in video we are at 5.11, 4.11. So let's wait and let's see how long it takes. So our system just restarted and it took less than five minutes though. It took like three minutes to install the first part of the installation so now we will boot to the next part boot mac os from usb now we go here and we boot mac os install for more so right now the blue color mentions i think 10.14 operating instead of internal or external hard drives we press install so remember you have to do this that once you install from usb then the other part is installing the system from hard drive So right now you can see the loading speed is quite more than USB. So it's a better sign and it should load quite fast on my NVMe SSD. So it can make me happy. Make me happy. And now it says it's gonna take 13 more minutes and let's see it's three or four right now and i shall pause this so we have we have restarted into our mac os again and now after the second installation we will go from here again to boot mac os so now this time it is boot mac os from mac mojave not install mac os mojave so we'll click enter and we'll see.
just loading pretty nice different devices are mounted different hardware is mounted NTFS NTFS file hard drive is mounted HDMI audio found on HDO so this might show that the HDMI audio will work like it used to work on previous Mac OS with the same text and now it's time to select our region which is Pakistan we say continue we say yes 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 I will sign up later skip I accept everything my ID which is Ibrahim space Muslim so my name is Ibrahim Muslim so it's not like I'm telling I'm Muslim the name of my father is Muslim and we say continue And yes, express setup. It's asking me to set some few more things, and I will say yes. I go with the Apple because I trust them. And now this is something new to Tender 14. This has never been available before. This so it's more Jave thing, and you can see that nice translation into black from white. And we go with the black, matte black, everything. And ta-da. So we have put it into 10 to 14. When you open this, you can see 10 to 14. My display doctor won't be loaded because it's NVIDIA and everything here. And what else? New trash can. If we go to launchpad, new voice memo. Let me know if you want to make want a video on this home. And one more thing, they said it released three things. One more thing. So our USB is loaded here. Let's go to system settings and see which things work. So my Ethernet is connected, my Wi-Fi is working, and my audio my usb audio is working but the hdmi audio is not working my mic is working as well and and what else display scale resolution is 16 by 20 currently i'm using a 4k monitor but if we focus here one more beautiful thing i love about mojave is this import from iphone and ipad and a couple of new backgrounds so this one is still you can use dynamic and it will show me the time of day I'm currently in and then these beautiful wallpapers I literally love them these new ones look at this these are beautiful this one this one this one this one every single one of them is beautiful and hello attractive and we go with this dynamic because we love new stuff and what else we have right now new notification we say okay night shift right here we go here a new a completely new app store is also one of the things you get in Mojave. A complete new look, duly noted, create, work, play. You can see it's beautiful. Develop, nicely categorized, updates. And one more thing you won't get system updates from app store now you'll get system update from software update in your system preferences automatically keep my mac updated or give it a rest right now i wish nvidia release the nvidia graphics card drivers as soon as possible or otherwise i'm getting a new amd rx 580 for this thing to work like charm so that's all for this video guys thanks for watching hope you liked it hope you enjoyed it 
and one more thing those who want to boot directly with your app from your hard drive you can just install and if you're using a 10.13.6 there are quite a lot of chances that there will be no error booting into Moje with that. So don't worry about that. Just give it a try. And if it messed up, you can use the USB and you should have a backup as always. And that's all for this video, guys. I hope you liked the video. And if you liked it, give it a thumbs up, share it, and tell your friends about this. And also help me on Patreon. You can get a lot more details on there. And I can personally text you what you can do up for your system and i know this video is late but this gonna be on the point so thanks for watching if you're still there and and i hope you love the video so until the very next video please take care allah hafiz